Good day, viewers. You are welcome. We want to solve this radical problem. I want to start from the left hand side, which is negative 2. So here we have negative 2, which uh, we can write it as 2 multiplied by minus 1. So the reason for this is looking at this problem we might think there is no solutions yeah but let's see how we can get the solution to this so minus one is known as i square in a complex space and on getting this i square we are going to replace it in the questions which is the square root of x plus two equals so instead of minus two we are going to write it as 2i square and next we are going to take the square root of both sides just to get rid of the square root and by doing that we are going to have the square root of x plus 2 all square equals 2i square all raised to the power of 2. And then this and this cancelled, we are left with x plus 2 equals. So in this 2, we take square and multiply by i square, we also take square. Then we have x plus 2 equals. 2 square is 4 multiplied by i to the power of 4. And to get the value of x, we consider from this i to the power of 4. And the left hand side still remain x plus 2 equals 4 multiplied by, while for this i to the power of 4, we can write it as i to the power of 2 all raised to the power of 2. And where i to the power of 2 is minus 1, raised to the power 2 and which is positive 1. So that's why we have 4 and therefore x equals 4 minus 2 which gives the result of x equals 2. And I will consider this as the fix method but we are going to verify if this is equal in the given problem where we have square root of 2 plus 2, this is not equals to minus 2 in a real space. But in the other side of it, I mean in the complex space of it, they are equal. That is, we have um, x equals 2, which is equal in a complex space. So let's consider this as the first step. Let's see the second method of solving this. So instead of passing through all these processes, we are going to take the square root of x plus 2 equals minus 2. So by writing this minus 1 as i square, we can just take the square root of both sides straight. And we have square root of x plus 2 all square equals minus 2 square. I did the first one just to prove that the value of uh, this x is equal in a complex space. That's why I used to use the i. And this cancelled, we have x plus 2 equals minus 2 square is 4. Then we get the value of x by transferring 2 to other sides. And where we have x equals 4 minus 2, which is 2, uh, the same answer. So we still have another method of solving this. And here is only two methods I presented. Thanks for watching and I hope you learned something today. And please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more exciting math content. And if you have any other opinions on how we can solve this, you can drop it in the comment box. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.